friends, I'm Molly from Spoke, and I'm so pleased to welcome you to the Spoke Club and to another demo in our Getting Started with Spoke series. In this training, we'll cover Room Visy. Visy is Spoke's tool for visualizing your rooms. Create realistic mockups and try out different options until you've created your dream space. Let's get into creating a Visy. You can create a Room Visy by clicking the plus button on your project on the Spoke homepage and selecting Create Room Visy from the dropdown. From here, we'll decide how we want to start our Visy. If it's your first time, I would highly suggest working through our guided tour of Visi, which can be found under Teach Me. This will give you a huge leg up in understanding how to use this tool. Check out our fancy templates to find some hand-selected room images you can add furniture and finishings to. The image option allows you to upload an image of your space and work from there. Custom will give you a blank slate room and a number of different perspectives, including some very helpful kitchen and bath templates. For this training, we'll start from scratch using a custom room. Let's jump in by setting up the room. Click on any wall to apply paint or wallpaper. You can use the color picker to add a custom color or select from our catalog of paint brands. Once you've found the perfect color, use the apply to all walls function to save yourself some time. If your room needs more character, you can choose from our community favorite wallpaper options or add your own by clicking on the plus icon under my wallpapers. Go to the image of the wallpaper you want to add Right click and select copy image address. Paste the copied address back into spoke, name your wallpaper and voila. Use the pattern size tool to increase or decrease the scale until it's just right. You can change the flooring by clicking back into room setup and selecting floor from the list. Check out our stock options or add your own the same way we did with wallpaper. I'll select this wood flooring for this room. Let's move on to windows and doors. While we're still in room setup, you'll be able to scroll through the available doors and windows and add them to the plan. I'm just gonna add a window for this room, so find the option you want and add it to the room. Drag it to the wall you want to add it to and it will be installed automatically. Tweak it in size until it's just right. One of my favorite things to do to make a room look realistic is to add outdoor scenery in the window. Scroll through and find your favorite option and then place it where the window is. Scale it to match the window and then click done and it'll automatically be layered behind the window for a realistic effect. Feel free to scroll through the rest of the options in room setup and add whatever it is your room needs. Now let's get into the best part, adding your furniture. Let's go through a couple different ways to do this. My things is where you can find any products and images that you've added to your projects. Think of this as your inventory. It's a great way to easily find things you like or have used in other projects. The product section is where you can start shopping. Find any and all products already in spoke. You can search by keyword or use our handy filters to make your search even easier. Filter by things like brand, category, or spoke sign to easily find the products that fit your vibe. I have a specific bed in mind for this project, so I'll filter for the brand I know and by bed under category. Now that we've found our product, add it to the design and bring it to life by removing the background. Click background in the top toolbar and then click magic and spoke will automatically remove the background for you. No more tracing outlines. If you can't find a product you're looking for in our list, no worries. We have several ways you can add any products you'd like to your design. Click the plus button on the product tab and then simply copy the URL from the product website and paste that copied web address into Spoke. Once added, you can magically remove the background by clicking the three dots and then click magic background erase. Once the background is erased, use the rotate tool and then move the object to the general area you want it to be in your design. To make this rug look like it's lying on the floor, we can use the skew tool in the edit bar and then toggle on auto angle. Spoke will auto apply perspective for you so that the rug looks like it's lying on the floor. With perspective applied, you can scale it until it's the perfect fit. Use the skew tool for anything from rugs on the floor to artwork on your walls. With the rug in place, use the layer tool to move the rug backwards so that it appears under any other pieces in the design. You could also move other pieces forward using the same tool. The inspo section is where you can find all of our stock images or upload your own. You could use this for things that aren't products, but you still want to show in your space. You can add your own image by clicking the plus at the top and then adding it either the same way we did with wallpaper using the copy paste image address or by simply dragging your image from your desktop into the upload area. With the image added, you can use all the same tools that we used for products. Fun stuff is where we've curated a bunch of things and images to make your space more fun and personal. I love to spend a little extra time scrolling through this section to give my design some character. This is also where you can find things like picture frames or curtains for your windows. 
My favorite tip is to use the style function to add with perspective automatically applied and save yourself some steps. Upload is a shortcut to add any products or images in the same ways we mentioned above. The text tool can be used to add text to your design to call out any specifics, and you can use the shapes tool to further customize your space. Now that you know how to use all the tools Spoke has to offer, start playing around. Add in different options and compare to decide what you like best until you've created your perfect dream space. Don't forget, you can always share your design to socials or download a JPEG or PDF. Make sure to check out our mood board walkthrough next to see how Spoke can help you set the vibe for your project.